What's up, guys? Got a cool build to show off. This is going out to uh, this is going out to Paul's kid. We had a custom Hufflepuff dial screen printed and loomed. So our theme colors there: are white, black, and like a yellowy with a, like a yellow orange there. So uh, brought that down through. They wanted it done in black and yellow. So we have yellow case. We have a solid one piece um, milled diver insert. Uh, so we did that in black with an inlay of yellow. But this is all one piece. It's a little tougher to Cerakote, but uh, black crown engraved. We've got a milled case back that was done in yellow Cerakote. Actually, it was done in black first, then yellow. Let's get it to, it doesn't know what to focus on here. Um, yellow, black was done first, then yellow, and then lasered off the yellow to expose the black. Why will not fuck? There we go. Uh, to expose the black that was underlay. Um, black case back ring. And then as you can see with the band, we did the whole thing in black, did the edges in yellow, and then on the tapered uh, double lock clasp, we did the yellow fold over with black clasp, lasered. We couldn't get everything they wanted lasered on here, but we were able to get the shield, we were able to get the wording that was there at the uh, at the trophy, which actually is super small. But uh, can I even read that? I don't think I can. That's that is a tough read, but it's probably just because everything on there is super 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 small. Um. But this thing came out awesome. Oh, and then I did a, a black handset. Happened to have one yellow uh, arrow second hand. This thing came out awesome. So everything they wanted lasered, lasered. We've got the shield on the back. I remember this image. I don't remember. I don't remember what that guy was. Um, we had the shield, we had the trophy with the uh, with the banner across it. We were able to get the banner on there. All done in black and yellow. Um, bezel will turn left, it'll turn right. It is on there super tight. Automatic mechanical so you can wind it, wear it, put it in a watch winder. But if it's dead or you're not going to be very active, make sure you wind it just a little bit. And how you do it is you back the crown off the threads until you hear it and feel it clicking. At that point, you can wind, and a wind is a turn this way. Turning it towards you doesn't do anything, but it's a lot easier to keep your finger spacing and just go back and forth. If you do this for four or five seconds before you put it on, even if you're not very active, you'll keep time throughout the day, and if you do it for something closer to 20 seconds, you're going to max out that 31-hour power reserve on it. You cannot overwind it, so don't worry about that. When you're happy with your winding, you'll pull it to the one and only click, and you can now set your time. You'll notice you've got a wobble crown that deflects lateral pressure from going into the stem and into the movements when you're pushing and prying on it. You are not putting any adverse pressure on anything. Okay, Google, what time is it? 12.39 p.m. When you're good, push it over, get it out of that time setting, and wind it down. That is the build. As with every build, it's going to come with matching beads. We're able to find stuff that went really well with it. Uh, this will just come in a black BBW special edition box. We'll come with the extra beads there for the family member that's a thief. <laughs> watch clearance is good on all glass and metal parts. So this whole watch. And then some fine scratch remover. 
<clears throat> this is Novus too from Amazon, just repackaged. It's like poly watch. It's for your acrylic glass because you can't scratch it. But if you do, no big deal. Put a tiny bit of this on it and buff it out using your included microfiber, which will probably be this one that you want to use. This brown one. I'll include a white one um, for your uh, watch spray. And uh, that's the build. I hope you love it. I hope she loves it, Paul. Um, if you want me to build you something custom and unique, reach out and I'll see what I can do. And if you want to continue to see videos like this, like and subscribe as I put them up all the time. Thanks, guys.